Today we're going to be looking at a C known as Genie, and I'm about to go into why we're looking at the C today and why it's proven to be quite the interesting seed that all of you have wanted me to check out. If you haven't already, be sure to subscribe and enable post notifications by ringing the bell, making it go ding. That's going to notify you of every future upload. I'm going to go ahead and grab my wood nags here. It looks like this bonus chest is not bad. It's full to the max, which every now and then you'll have a bonus chest that, you know, doesn't have, it's not fully like filled like this look at this we have bread we have sticks we have everything it, it, it's quite the exciting thing to see but either way there's a cow coming to greet us as we start off this video and start off our brand new seed world showcase investigation thingy bob whatever you want to call it here on minecraft as always i'm ong uh, delivering daily minecraft content uh, and uh, well you know every time you guys subscribe and leave a like it always greatly appreciate it but uh Ooh, I'm about to switch away from my wooden axe. That would have been quite treacherous. Either way, we are here, and be sure to hit that like button, guys. Every like is spares a cow from not dying. All right, so you want cows to live, you're gonna like the video, okay? I'm sorry to all the vegans out there, but either way, um, yeah. So we're here today to look at the seed known as genie now grant you any wish you know grant any wish that you say um i wanted to investigate the seed a lot of people are saying that they are encountering very very special items on this world from the loot um and i thought that was very interesting uh because like and what I mean by that is people are saying that they're finding loot, you know, be it if it's in a mob spawner or a village, they're finding loot and it's like super, super good. So it's like granting you with like all your wishes in Minecraft. So, you know, apparently this seed grants your wish in any command in Minecraft if you truly wish for it enough on this seed. So I thought this was very interesting. I was like, so it's kind of like having a genie in Minecraft, right? It's like granting your wishes and stuff. So what this entails and what I've been reading on is apparently this seed, you can find items in the seed that is exceptionally good. Now for the bonus chest, you know, we got a bonus chest that was completely full, uh, which is not always the case. So that's really cool. We got a bonus chest full of many, many items that we can just use at our disposal. Um, and next up, we're going to try to find some loot and see if the loot is insanely good. So I'm looking for like an enchanted weapon or something maybe. I don't know. Let's go ahead and go to game mode C. And let's just take a look at the seed in general. Uh, there's a little X here. Perhaps X marks the spot. Let's see. Let's see if X marks the spot. We're going to need some torches too. Yeah, okay. I don't think X marked the spot for anything there. That was a complete doll. Um, I always see those little X's, you know, the plus symbols or X's, however you would like to look at them and view them in Minecraft, but they normally don't ever lead to anything, which is quite odd. All right, here seems to be a cave system that kind of curves down through there. Let's go ahead and get some torches so we can see. Um... And if you guys find anything good on the seed, be sure to post the coordinates in the comment section below so everybody else can also find and check it out. We also want to see what value this seed holds in terms of generation, perhaps it's, you know, villages and stuff. Like, it's always nice to find a village near spawn, but I don't know if that's really going to happen on the seed. There's, like, a lot of plains, so usually villages like to, you know, favor these. We have a swamp over here with, like, a witch hut, I'm imagining. Hopefully, just maybe. Maybe. One witch hut. None. Well, darn. It's kind of disappointing, isn't it? Oh, no, no, no. Did I see one? No. Thought I did. I'll never forget when we found Ben Drown in, like, one of the swamps in one of the Minecraft worlds. That was terrifying. If you guys don't know what I'm talking about, video, old video on my channel. Uh, if you guys know what Ben Drowned is, then you kind of already know that's terrifying alone, just mentioning it. But, um, either way, I don't see any terrain. I see a lot of, like, flowers. Like, this is, like, one of the flower biomes or whatever. Uh, I'm trying to find loot because people are saying that in the chest on the seed there's super good stuff. So here's a ravine. Now if I could find a spawner, this would be a great like kind of initiation into this like investigation. Now if you guys don't know and you may be new to the channel, what we do here, we investigate seeds. Uh, claims that people have made on these seeds. We see if they're valid, see if they have any, you know, backup evidence. We see what it's all about. We see if it's anything to look at and if the seed truly is, like, mysterious or weird or anything like that. And mind you this, there are weird seeds out there, seeds that hold absolute pure amazement. Um, you know, one of those being, like, the triple six seed that we always look at. Like, if you haven't seen that, you need to go watch one of our recent videos on that. But, like... There are some very strange Minecraft seeds. That's why, you know, this may seem a little far-ish. Like, the, okay, the genie world granting you with, like, super good items and stuff. Yeah, right. 
Well, y you think that till it actually happens, and that's that's the weird thing. Like Minecraft has some weird seeds, and I've learned not to even just just you know just throw it to the side. Like at least investigate it, at least give it a little sneak peek, you know, and just see what the seed truly holds. That way, I'm not judging it too quick because I've seen anything and everything happen in this game. I'm telling you guys, there's been some creepy run-ins. Um, here's another swamp. No, no witch hut. No witch hut. We haven't seen a structure at all. Not even that of a village. Very, very odd. Oh, this is the same uh, swamp, actually. I thought I found another one. <laughs> but, um... Alright, let's just go down this way. Go on over here. Kind of taking it. We're, we're kind of wanting to stay near spawn here. So we get kind of like a basis. That way, if any of you guys play the seed as well, you'll be able to see what's going on uh, around the same area. And, um, I don't see anything too fancy. Like, I want to find a chest to see if the loot is really good. Ah, uh, here we are. Now, hopefully... Now, this is near spawn, too, by the way, guys. So, there is a village near spawn. That's good. And is there a blacksmith? No. There's no blacksmith. That's quite disappointing because I wanted to check the loot. Now, if you notice with the new update, guys, the village has cats now. So, the villagers actually have pets. I thought that was really cool and unique. Personally, uh, that villagers have pets now, little cats roaming around. I don't know, I just think it's just a nice little addition. So there was no armory, you know, blacksmith, so that kind of throws that away. Ooh, 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 desert, guys. This means it could be a desert pyramid or a temple, whatever one you like to call it. If this is the case, then we may be able to find something great. And I feel like if there was a genie in Minecraft, it would probably be in a desert pyramid or something. You know, ancient as it is. I feel like it would. If you guys see anything weird in this video, be sure to post it in the comment section below. Uh, as you guys know, I happen to overlook a lot of things. Um, so, we're taking a look at this now. I just feel like if there was, like, any genie in Minecraft, of course it's going to be in the desert, dude. Like a pyramid or temple or something. Like, it just, it's too fitting for it. It really is. Now, this is a huge desert. If we don't find one pyramid. Oh, there it is. There it is, folks. Now we get to see if the loot is truly good in the seed or not. Ah, let's cross over. Ooh, there's a there's a ravine under there. I mean, in terms of like having a village and stuff, that's pretty nice. All right, guys. Why is that chest? Why are these chests not facing outward? Golden apple, not bad. Enchanted book, not bad. And horse armor, two golden apples. An enchanted apple. That's like a notch apple, isn't it, guys? Look, there's regular golden apples. And an enchanted golden apple, guys. The loot on this seed is way better than expected. And I, I hear a skeleton. Guys, maybe this is... Maybe you guys was not kidding. This is real. Where's the skeleton? I think it's below. We're about to find out. No, I want my enchanted... Ah, got it. Alright, where are you, skeleton? I heard a skeleton. Guys, everywhere I go, skeletons just follow me. I don't see nothing. That means it had to be like, to the side or something. This looks like a desert well or something, maybe. Guys, I don't know. We don't have a lot of time to investigate the sea. But from what I found in that pyramid, not bad at all. Perhaps the sea does back up its claims a little bit. Sorry I doubted you guys. But not only did we find multiple golden apples, but we found an enchanted notch apple, guys. Now, that is nuts. That is absolutely nuts, guys. The, the golden apple was one thing, but the enchanted apple, whoa. That really, really blew it out of the water. The, of course, there's more that I want to explore this seed and see if we can get even better loot in the genie world. But I think the genie world does hold its own weight in, like, wealth. And I think maybe you guys were right about finding really good loot on this world. So a successful seed showcase, the only problem is you have to find the chest 
to get the good loot. So, yeah, I don't know, guys. This is something to put under the belt. Something for you guys to kind of investigate, have fun with as well for yourself. If you guys enjoyed this and want to see more Seed World showcases, be sure to leave them in the comments section below. Uh, what world you would like me to check out next and why and what you think is on that world that I should check out. Or if you just noticed something creepy happening on that world or something. Let me know, dude. Anyways, appreciate you guys. Hope you guys are having a great New Year's. All that good stuff. And I will see you all in the next one.